Hello, and in this tutorial, we're going to start talking about linked lists. So what is a linked list? Well, it's a data structure and data structures hold data. So the closest comparison is the built in array. An array is a data structure. It holds data. So we're going to actually start discussing what, what it is our linked list is going to be implemented, how it's going to be implemented, and what methods are we going to implement. So our linked list is going to use a dummy node. And this dummy node has a bunch of other nodes. And these nodes all together create a linked list. So what is a node? Well, a node is this rectangle shape we have here. One part has the data and the other part has a reference to another node. So that's essentially what our linked list is going to be consisted of. A bunch of nodes referencing other nodes. So in order to implement this, we're going to have a couple of fields. We're going to have a last node field, a header field, and a size field. Well, the last node field is going to reference the last node in our linked list. And the header field is going to reference the first node in our linked list. Size is going to be obviously the size or the number of elements in our linked list. We're going to be implementing a constructor, no argument constructor. Prepend and append, you can guess what these two do. Prepend, add to the front of the list. Append, add to the back of the list. Get size, return the size of the linked list. To string, print out all the elements of the linked list. Remove first, remove the first node in our linked list. Remove last, remove the last node in our linked list. And finally, we're going to have remove at and insert at. So remove at is going to remove a node at a particular index. And insert at is actually going to insert a node at a particular index. And in the upcoming tutorials, we're actually going to be implementing our very own linked list and is going to be implementing all these methods you see here.